Hello. 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 Okay, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Good evening. How are you? Okay. Okay. So we start at seven thirty-eight. Okay, wait. Mm. I think we have to to finish at exact time, like at eight p.m. Okay. 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 Because of another student. Okay, so we, let's continue. Okay, so okay. I have mm -hmm. so I have another activity now. It's same as last time. It's still a crossword puzzle game. And this is the topic for that summer. So there is a clue and then try to answer, okay? Maybe okay. you can mm -hmm. It's not very hard, so I think you can answer. You can start with a cross or you can start with down. It's up to you, okay? Okay. Okay. And when you answer, read and then answer. Or read silently and then let me know after. Okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Choose first. Okay, let's start from across. Grains on the beach. Mm -hmm. Grains on the beach. I don't know what is it. Okay, it's okay. You can skip. You don't need to answer all. Okay. Okay. I skip. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Continue. Number one is skip. Number... Five living in the tent. Mm hmm Living in the tent. Wait for me. Mm hmm I skip. Because I don't know. Mm -hmm. Too hard to read. Mm -hmm. Okay, when you live in the tent, what do you call that? When you... Living? Yeah, or you when you sleep in the tent. What is that called? Sleeping. Not sleeping. sleeping. Yeah, not sleeping. You're in the tent, so that is called... Like when you go outside staying. and... Not staying. There's... A word for that. Like you, okay, let's go blank. Let's build a tent and sleep in there for tonight. Let's go blank. A uh, blank. Not blank. Let's go. Okay, I will give you one bonus answer. Number five, living in, oh, no, 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 not five. Grains on the beach. What do you call the one on the beach? You go to the beach. What do you call the grains in there? What do you call there? The sand. grains. Okay, that's the sand. That's correct. So here is that, right? Across. S A N D. Sand. That's correct. Okay, next. You skip five so you can. Go with seven. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Wait for me. It warms you up. Anything is heat. Mm -hmm. It warms you up heat. That's seven, one, two. Okay, that's correct. Heat. Two-wheel transportation. Mm -hmm. Two-wheel transportation. Bike. There's... Oh, yes. Wait, number... Number eight, bike. B-I-K-E. That's correct, bike. Next. Okay. Mm -hmm. Number nine. Next, it comes with a shovel. Okay, do you know what is a shovel? Yes, I know. Yeah, shovel. It could be a big, dig. it could be... What? It is dig. Dig? No. It, it like, it's like a partner with the shovel. If you, when you go to the beach, you have a shovel, right? For kids. And what? There, it, it's a partner, right? It's a pair. When you buy a shovel, there is a partner for that. So what is this called? You shuffle the sand and you put it on the... What? Do you know what is it called? Like the one you... There's a holder and then there's a shovel. You put the sand in there, right? So right. what is this called? With a handle. You can skip if you don't know yet. You can go back later. I skip. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Number 10. But then it comes with a uh, full of daylight. Yeah, full of daylight. Full of daylight. I skip. Mm -hmm. Skip first. We can go back to that later. Number 11. A sandy shore. Okay. You know shore? Yes. Okay. A sandy shore. So what is that called? A sandy shore. Where can we see a sandy shore? Mm-hmm. Desert. There's no shore in the desert. We oh, can only beach. Mm, okay. There's no shore in the desert. It's in the beach. Okay. So eleven B E A C H. Okay. So you have to spell also. Okay. Tell me the spelling of um for other words. Okay. 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 Twelve. Mm -hmm. Area of island water. Mm, inland. Inland water. Mm -hmm. oh, inland. inland water. Mm -hmm. Lake. Spell. L A K E. Okay, that's correct. Inland, meaning there is the water is inside. The land, so it's a lake. That's right. Number fifteen, across. Uh, warmest three months of the year. Mm hmm. Warm it. Warmest three months of the year. Fifteen. Yeah, that's easy. I if. June, July, and May. No, no. What is that cold? The warmest Summer. three months. Okay. Summer. Can you spell? S-U-M-N-E-R. Okay, that's correct. Because I'm counting also the blocks here or the squares. That's why you have to spell it. Okay, 16.
Wait. Mm -hmm. Top of warm weather. Mm -hmm. Top means not the top. Top means like clothes. Top clothes. Wait. T-shirt. Yeah, wait. Can you spell? T H T S H I R T. Okay, that's correct. T S H I R T. Okay, very good. That's correct. So you skip three from across. Now let's start with down. How about down? Down, plunging mm -hmm. to the water. Plunging. I don't know what plunge, like, plunging is. You know, like there's a plunge, like a water plunge. You know, like you have dropped something and then there's plunge of water. You know that? Like water. And then there's, you drop something and then there's plunge. Like that. Understand? That's plunging into the water. I skip. Okay, that's okay. Skip for now. We can always go back later. Three. Down. Move through the water. Yeah, move Surf? through. Through. Uh, it could be, but no. Another one. Surf, it could be a, you can move through the water surfing, yeah. But there is there an, another one for that? Surf is also fits here though, S-U-R-F, yeah. Another activity where you move through the water. Like you can move freely through the water. I don't know. It's easy. You got surf, and that's easy too. But the correct answer is more easier. Move through Swim. the. Okay. <laughs> See? That's more easy than the surf. Okay. Move through the water is swim. S W I M. That's right. Next. Very good. See? Mm -hmm. Number four. Summer hazard. Mm -hmm. Summer hazard. So hazard. I'm not sure if we. Yes, I know hazard. Yeah, I think you know hazard. Summer hazard. So what do you, will you get during summer? Or. Flood, tsunami, storm. Summer? We can't have tsunami on summers. Usually, oh. tsunami are like for earthquakes. So if there's a very hot weather in any other places, what possible calamity will happen or hazard? Like in rainy season, the hazard would be flood, right? How about right, but... mm -hmm, during summer? Drain, I forgot. So for rain, that would be flood. Yeah, rain or like landslide. Oh, dry. Dry, yeah, that's close. That's also correct though. Can you give me another one? Aside from dry, because here it's four letter. Four letter, summer hazard, number four down, four down, one, two, three, four. Dry or drought is correct for that, summer hazard. But they are asking for four letter word only. 
I don't know. Okay, it's okay. Let's skip for now. I will not tell you the answer. Maybe you will know later. Number five. House in the woods. Yeah, what do you call the house that you can see in the woods? Woods means in the forest, okay? Tree house. Not in the tree house. Like, not a house on the tree. It's just a house inside the forest. What do you call that house? Not on the tree. Not up on the tree. Wait. Mm -hmm. There's a cold or a name for that one. Oh, your house is in the forest. So that is a... Lumber shack is lumber house. Close, but not lumber house. Okay, I think we have to skip this one. Okay, we will continue with all skip words later. How about six? Number okay. six. Mm -hmm. It's okay. So we can answer article. Number six is mm -hmm. frozen treat. Yeah, treat. You know treat, right? Yes. Treat, like not treating. Treat someone. Yeah, that's a different one. Treat, like food treats. Treats like food, okay? Ice cream. Oh, yeah, that's correct. Frozen treat, that's correct. Ice cream is a frozen treat, that's correct. Okay, seven. Trail walking. Mm -hmm. Trail walking. When you walk, going to a trail in the mountain, what is that called? When you go on a trail. Hiking. That's correct. Good job. Number nine. Number, Number nine. nine is... Yes. Please read. Wait. Mm hmm A place to swim. Yeah. C. Four letter. It's down. Nine, one, two, three, four. What? C is correct, okay? But let's find a four letter answer. Lake. Lake is also correct. What else? That's not the correct answer. Ocean. No, not four letter. What other from aside from nature? What's a man made? Pool. Okay, correct. A pool. Good job. Oh, last three. Ten. Ten. Ten is. Mm -hmm. Wait, I need to think what ten is. Can you read first? I think ten is pants for hot weather. What will you wear on your bottom if it's hot weather? Will you wear a jeans? Ten is oh. One, two, three, four, five, six letters. Pants for hot weather. Mm -hmm. Pants shorts. That's correct. Shorts. S-H-O-R-T-S. That's right. Shorts. Number 13. Last two. Okay. I need to think. Mm-hmm. Toy for the windy day. Mm -hmm. Kite. That's right. So usually when 
the weather is windy, it's good to, to play a kite. Last one. Last. Last one is mild, mildly hot. Yeah, mildly hot. So it's not very hot, just mild. So what weather is that? Right. It's four letter, okay. one, two, three, four. Yeah, not so hot. So the weather is just... Okay. Mm-hmm. Wait. Mm -hmm. I don't know what is it. Mm -hmm. It's okay. So let's also we will continue that next time so that we can continue with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, you skipped seven words for this puzzle. And not bad. That's okay. Just seven. So we will continue that next time, okay? Okay. Okay, so let's do the questions now, article. Okay, please wait. I'll... Wait. Yeah, okay, wait. I cannot see. Yeah, okay, wait first. Not yet. Hey, wait, sorry. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so last time we stopped at how should parents screen their children's eating habits. So we will continue with teen talk tonight. And hopefully we will finish also. Okay, can you see the screen now? Yes. Okay, wait. So we will continue with teen talk, okay? Okay. Okay, you can read teen talk number one. Wait. Mm-hmm. Teen talk number one. What may happen is if where parents do everything for child. Should mm -hmm. they do nothing what child said? Mm -hmm. Okay, what may happen if parents do everything for their child? Answer that first. What what may happen? If they do everything. Everything, okay? The child will uh, mm -hmm. do thing that they don't need any they don't need to do everything. Yeah, they don't need to their parents do all all of the team. Mm -hmm. And will it be good for the child or would it be bad for the child? It's bad for a child. Yeah, that's right. It will be a bad thing for the child, especially when he or she grows up in the future, right? Maybe good for only now. Right. But in the future, it will not be good. So there's another question. Can you read again? Should they do nothing for their child then? No. I think if they can do it, they cannot do nothing because because if they don't do nothing, the child will be sad and cannot do everything because they don't have some from the parents. Mm -hmm. for the okay, so should it be equal? Like sometimes do for the kids, sometimes don't also? Is that 
right? I think yeah, sometimes do for the kid and sometimes don't. Okay, that's good. So yeah, it's it should be balanced, right? That okay, I will do yeah. for you, but there's also time that you have to do it for yourself, right? Do you do that too? Right. You mm -hmm. do you do that also like you let your parents do something for you, but not all of the things you want them to do. Just you ask sometimes and you do other things. You do that or no? Yes, sometimes my parents do mm -hmm. help me. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's good. If you ask for help, that's also okay, right? And if you can do it by yourself, and then that's better. You can just do it by yourself. Okay, good job. Number two. Okay. Number two is wait. What will happen if parents don't use uh, the word wrong to the child? Mm, it, it's um coming back again. What will happen if parents don't use the word word okay the word wrong to their child? Should they always use, okay, that's wrong. Okay, or, or that's very wrong. Stop it. Is it okay to use the word wrong? Or we have to avoid it? And if they don't use the word wrong, I think they would think that they are right and mm -hmm. they will do anything and the parents uh, didn't say wrong and they think always is right. Yeah, that's also a good idea. Like if you will, if the parent will not say wrong, Okay, you, what you did is wrong, then the child will not know that it's wrong. They will only think that, oh, maybe this is right because my parent did not say I'm wrong. That's also a good idea. Very good. Yeah. Number three. Number three is... Wait... Mm -hmm. It's okay. Number three is why is it dangerous to let the children read anything they want? Or do you disagree? Yeah. Do you understand the question? I will not explain more. Yes. Okay. Why is it dangerous to read everything they want? Why? I think some uh, books are dangerous. Yeah. Some books are dangerous. There might be something that's not good for the kids, right? Like there like in the movie, there's like 13 plus, 15 plus, 18 plus, which is not good for the kids. Plus. Yeah, that's right. So in books, there are also like that. And kids should not read that books, kind of books, because it might be dangerous yeah, for right. them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. Number four. Number four is wait. Mm -hmm. it's okay. Number four is what's wrong with parents are arguing with the pressure of their own children. Yeah, in the presence. What's wrong with the parents argu arguing in the presence of their own of their own children? Like, is it wrong if the parents are like fighting, arguing while? Their kids are around them. Is that wrong? It is not. Like parents fighting, like blah, 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 blah. And then the kids are just looking at them. Is that okay? It's not okay. Okay, why it's not okay to let the kids hear the parents fighting and like arguing? Why it's not good? Because mm -hmm. if we see that, if the children see that, they will be so sad. And yeah, they will the be so sad. And then learn. And learn? And I think they will learn. Yeah, I think they will learn how to fight. Yes, learn the fight from the parents. Yeah, that's right. And I think that's not good because they 
should just be like thinking um kid thing not about the problem of the parents right there's sh they should not know about it so it's not good for the kids kids should be only for kids problems of parents should be just for the parents kids should not know about it especially if very young still right do you agree right okay so we will end there we will continue on monday okay 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 thank you Vu. see you on monday thank you bye bye okay bye bye, bye. good night